Hey, what's up everyone? Today I have an unboxing. Pretty excited. Just got this delivered. This is the, sometimes I can't remember the names of this stuff, Kayer BV30L 72 inch professional heavy duty aluminum twin two tripod K3 fluid head. That's a lot to say. Well, let's get into the unboxing. Don't have a knife yet. I still gotta invest in one. Okay, looking at the bag first. The bag bag is oh seems sturdy. The outside seems very studded, sturdy. Got the cav K K -er. See that on the outside. Let's get this open. Also from the uh, the exterior of the uh, carrying bag, carrying case bag. You have some hooks right here. Reach in. And also some handles. Carry it like that. Got some soft padding throughout the bag too. That'll definitely be in protection. And also right inside of there, got uh, an extra base plate and some Allen keys. Not too bad, the weight is not too bad. This is serious, this is sturdy. I'm gonna set this up. Alrighty, time for a closer look at this tripod, the construction of it seems to be of some high quality. Aluminum legs, you do have some plastic, a little turn knob here locking to lock the legs. Definitely locks right there. Got your K-er, if that's the way you pronounce it. Correct me in the comments. You got the head right here, pretty solid. You got an extra mounting point right here for some accessories to the tripod. Maybe a uh, um, Atomos, ninja monitor or whatever you've got a uh, locking plate lever right here so if you want to take that completely off and put it on once that's locked like that if your camera's on here if the head tilts forward you don't have to worry about your camera taking a nose dive your expensive camera or my expensive camera you've got your locking lever right here which Okay, yeah, that's for that. My bad. Turn it around here. Got your locking lever right here. This locks, makes this tighter. Loosen it up. You can tighten it down. Okay, I get it. It's screwing this right here. It's a little area, another area down in here, area down in here. You have to make sure that's nice and tight also. Yeah. There you go. Yep. So this basically keeps this from turning, this head from turning right here. All right, let's open this up. Let's, oh, one more thing. There's a leveler right here. It's not the, you can see that down in there, little green thing right there. Your leveler. So that, uh, Show you if you're level on that. Okay, Look around it a bit more. The feet on here, are pretty good. And they looks like they will. Uh, the feet will. They swivel, so they'll uh, adapt to whatever you know. 
whatever type of ground would you know if the ground is uneven or whatever this will these will adapt to it all right let's open this baby up okay i'm going to start from this area down here open these up just drop these on down like that tighten it up And once you loosen them, the tension is totally, the tension on the legs are, is totally released. See, they just fall right down. Just pull it on out. Like that. Make sure you can see me, see me, see the tri tripod. Oh yeah. Right. Okay, let me. Loosen up this. This this is nice. I like this. <laughs> and the head on here feels really smooth. This is uh, I'm gonna go ahead and and take this and make it. It's a 72 inch, so we're gonna go ahead and make it uh 72 inches. Quick deployment. Definitely taller than me. I'm not a tall. I'm only like five, 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 six. I like my. I like my height. So this thing's got to be like six something. Well, seventy-two inches. Okay, the, I have a plate with my S18. Let me go ahead and get it, matter of fact. This is my S1H. This is primarily why I bought this uh, tripod. This is why I bought, purchased this tripod so I can put this heavy, heavy uh, camera on it, the S1H. So I'm gonna go ahead. This plate should be compatible with this head. But I'm going to find out right now. Okay, here I have my Panasonic S1H. I'm going to take the uh, plate that's on, already on the uh, tripod here. I'm going to take this off. Should so that is compatible with that. This is an iFootage plate that I have on this uh, Panasonic S1H. I have the mount, have it mounted on the camera already. So that's a that's a definite plus right there. Now I'm going to go ahead and put the uh, arm on here, the panning arm for the tripod. Got the panning arm right here, and this this is solid. This is a metal right here. And this is kind of like of a rubbery part right here. Feels pretty good in the hand, and you can put it on the right side you can put it on right here or you can mount it over here depends on if you're right or left handed I'm right handed so I'll put it on the right hand side yeah Very fluid, very smooth. I'm gonna point out some other things with this tripod also. Now, if your camera is ever unleveled, it's not leveled, you don't have to undo these leg, say, holders right here that keep the legs from moving up and down you don't have to mess with these you can just grab this handle in the middle right here and unscrew it and get your camera level with this real easy as you can see here 
I'll turn it that way. And I can, uh, right there. It's leveled. And this part right here in the middle, these brackets right here, these, these are metal. So that's also, that's good for sturdiness. Now, some other things that I like about this, uh, features I like about this Zayer cave care tripod head is when you pan, when you pan, when you're panning, it's very smooth. I'm gonna loosen this panning button all the way up. Very smooth. Very smooth. You don't get any this, that, that, or this. You can get with this or you can get, I'm just kidding. But you don't get any of that. And this, when you loosen the tilt, I guess this is the tilt knob. Is that you can do it? Like that you can fully loosen it up. Oh, another thing I like. <laughs> that scared the hell out of me for real. Um, I didn't have the button over here tightened up. That's why it slid like slid like that. But you see, it didn't fall. I was I was about to get to that, and it didn't fall off of there. Let me tighten that up. There we go. Very nice and smooth. This is this Kayer um, tripod is definitely a keeper. But right now, let's go into some panning footage. Well, that will conclude this video. This video, I took a look at the Kayer, 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 I gotta get that name right. Kayer tripod, this is a fluid head tripod. I think it uh, has very good quality, aluminum build and some high quality plastic. Uh, not only the tripod, I think the uh, carrying case is um, very, very nice and I think it's going to be very protective when transporting the uh, tripod. Overall, I think this is a great package and I would recommend this highly if you're considering purchasing a uh, high quality professional style tripod. And then with that being said, 
comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching this one. Take care. Peace. Thank you.